True Thomas. True Thomas lay on Huntley Bank. A fairly he spud o' his ee. And there he saw a lady brecht come riding down by the elden tree. Her skirt was o' the grass green silk, her mantle o' the velvet fine, at Elkate to her horse's mane. Hung fifty silver bells and nine. True Thomas pulled off his cap and looted Lord Dun tall his knee. All hail, thou mighty Queen of Heaven, for thy peer on earth I never did see. Oh, no, no, Thomas, she said, that name does not belong to me. I am but the queen of fair elf land that I'm hither come to visit thee. Harp and carp, Thomas, she said, Harp and carp along with me. And if you dare to kiss my lips, Share o' your body I will be. Betide me wheel, betide me way. That weird shall never daunt on me, sign he has kissed her rosy lips all underneath the olden tree. No ye man gang wi me, she said, true Thomas ye man gang wi me. And ye mun serve me seven years, through weal and woe as me chance to be. She mounted on her milk white steed, she's taen through Thomas up behind, and I when e'er her bridle rung, the steed flew swifter than the wind. Oh, they read on and farther on, the steed did swifter than the wind, until they reached a desert wide, and leaving land was left behind. Lecht doon, lecht doon, no true Thomas, and lean your head upon my knee. Abide and rest a little space, and I will show you fearless three. Oh, see you know your narrow road, so thick beset with thorn and briars, that is the path of righteousness. Though after it but few inquires, and see you know that breed breed road that lies across that lily leaven, that is the path o wickedness. Though some call it the road to heaven, and see you know that bonny bonny road. That winds about the ferny bray, that is the road to fair elf land, where thou and I this nacht mun gae. But Thomas, ye man, hold your tongue. 
whatever ye may hear or see, for if you speak word in Elfland land, yes'll ne'er get back to your own country. Sign they came on to a garden green, and she put an apple free a tree. Tak this for thy wages, true Thomas. It will give the tongue that can never leave. My tongue is my in, true Thomas said. A deadly gift he would give to me. I neither dot a bain or sell, at fair or tryst what I may be. I dot neither speak to prince or peer, nor ask of grace from fair lady. Now hold thy peace, the lady said, for as I say, so it must be. He has gotten a coat o' the even cloth, and a pair of shoon o' velvet green, and till seven years were gain and past, true Thomas on earth was never seen.